Hey guys, today we are going to talk about a turn zero modern win. Now this is not something that can be duplicated, but it would be kind of fun to do it once or twice. Your opponent has to be playing a 60 card deck, which typically they are, and your opponent has to probably be in blue. So they're going to draw seven cards on their turn, they're going to win the dice row, they're going to win the coin flip, and they're going to choose to play first, which is typical. Or you can, if you win the dice row or the coin flip, you can choose to play second. So now they have a 60 card deck, they draw seven, they have 53 cards left. Now they play a fetch land, they crack the fetch land, they look for a island or a shock land of some type that can play blue. And from that, they have 52 cards left. They're going to play Visions. Visions says draw a card, but in response to it, you're going to archive trap him four times. So each archive trap reads if an opponent uh, search his or her library uh, this turn, you may pay zero rather than pay its casting cost, or its mana cost. Target opponent puts the top 13 cards of his or her library into his or her graveyard. So your opponent has 52 cards in his deck because they cracked the fetch land. They have visions on the stack. You play four archive traps on them. Four times 13 is 52. 52 cards mill out of the library. And they still have to draw the card because of visions. And before even playing a single land or a single normal card, you have milled your opponent in turn zero. And that's quite incredible. The circumstances are minimal at least. Like I don't know what the probability of this happening is, but you need to draw four archive traps. You need an opponent who's playing blue, who's going to put visions on the stack after playing a fetch land and cracking the fetch land. And you need an opponent who's playing a 60 card deck. So a lot of this is not atypical and modern. Fetch land, Island, Visions is a very typical play for a blue deck. What is not typical is that in your hand you have four Archive Traps. Pretty OP and definitely one of probably the worst ways to lose even before, I mean you're just trying to play your Visions and then you get milled out by your own Visions. And that's probably why I like this combo so much is because the last card that you're drawing or the last card your opponent draws to lose the game or cannot draw in this case is because they play divisions right they have to draw the card off divisions after everything resolves overall a fascinating turn one win or not even turn one just turn zero win because you haven't really had your turn yet all your opponents it's it's just crazy that you can mill out an opponent this way in this fashion so leave me a comment below if you guys know of any other turn zero wins and I look forward to uh, reading your comments. Bye, guys.